Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, your girl Jenny Fine. How are you guys doing? Uh, we're in the month of July, and this year is actually really going fast. Before you know, it's gonna be August, September, and December. Yeah, I just want to quickly, like, you know, share my top, like, new favorite um concealer. Probably you've already seen from the title. I remember doing this a video like this about a year, almost a year now. It's gonna be a year in August, so it could be like 10 months or 11 months now, and it's is called 10 best concealers with yellow goldy or warm deep or the tones for women of color or dark skin and i'm really impressed about the engagement i got from that video like i wasn't when i'd make that video i was thinking maybe nobody's gonna watch it because it's actually long it was about 34 minutes video this is 2019 and think new brands have come out with new products or probably it's old brands have come up with new um concealer for more um inclusivity or for women of color so i feel like you know let me do another one so this is not going to be a top 10 um i really got like almost eight concealer in front of me three out of repeat from my last video that's just because it's my favorite and i really like it and like how it feels on my skin and i do have like a list of um what the other tools are sometimes saying it on my head i'm just gonna get confused i'm just gonna ramble a lot and this video is just gonna be long so guys this is a talking video and i'm make sure it's not gonna be 30 minutes like the last time okay i'm gonna be showing you mine i don't know how many i feel like doing top five or top six favorite concealer for this video but because i do have a repeat of the one i like i'm just gonna quickly throw that in there to might be like top eight but in reality this is like a top five product i'm gonna be sharing with you guys my favorite is always the number one which is always put towards the last part of this video number one and my list is always at the beginning so you know what guys i'm just gonna do it i'm just gonna share my top eight uh best concealer for golden to yellow on the two for women of color and dark skin ladies out there okay so my least favorite is this f concealer it's called deep olive it's a 16 hour camo concealer the reason why is my least concealer is because this concealer is good it's beautiful on different skin tone but on my skin tone it actually comes out really really yellow i have to like cancel it out with my foundation or we top it up on that concealer but i really love the coverage it gives it's super full coverage it's creamy it blends really well you know it's everything you want in a concealer but the fact of the undertone is that it's too yellow for me i kind of see more of the yellow than the goldenness and so if i use this on on the on that skin type like more darker skin type it will come out really beautiful and because as a makeup artist i do use some of my product on my clients so i do see when a product is working out well so it does come out beautiful and i feel like oh this this concealer is good i can still work with it you know mm -hmm. so that's my least favorite and this is my top eight favorite concealer and number seven least favorite concealer is the jeffree star concealer about this year 2019 jeffree star release is concealer line and this is called c21 um the reason why is my least concealer is just because it's too light for me i feel it's too light for me but it's really good comparing this shade with the half shade this is actually more golden and the f is more yellow you can see a bit of the difference jeffree star c21 concealer it says to be for a medium to deep skin with golden yellow undertone guys i think my skin is a skin that has various undertone sometimes i might be neutral i might be golden i might be warm i might be yellow like but the only thing i cannot be is red pink and rosy undertone that i cannot be but i my skin is in between neutral cool golden yellow and warm undertone and you know it goes back and front back and front depending on the season that that's why I have various type of concealer and they work variously and with different uh, foundation and it still comes out to look the same. This is a golden order turn and I believe a lot of women of color is going to like this shade. And again, the reason it's my number seven, I don't really like it that much is because I don't know. 
I've tried it twice or three times whenever I am using it under my eye and I'm blending it out I feel like it moves the product so there's concealer and I'm blending it out so it removes where I just blend out and when I continue blending it's like it just removes the product while I am blending that's the only thing I feel that I don't like about it and I thought probably it's me on my beauty blender but I did change a beauty blender and it still does the same thing so I just feel like you know I've used a lot of concealer that I know when a product is moving and the reason why I don't think it's my um, primer or my foundation because I have tried different primer different foundation to see what's actually tr wrong I just think it's concealer maybe it's just me I don't use it that often and it's not going to be my number five on my number one probably if I had to buy again if I had to buy it, I might have to go with C22. I just feel that's probably just like a, you know, a balanced concealer that I really like to use. And I hope it does not move product as well. That's my number list seven. So my list um six favorite concealer, Maybelline anti Age Eraser. And this is in the shade um, Tan 11. Um, This was part of my video about a year ago, video, top 10 video. And this was in my top two or top three videos and at that time I really like it over time I've kind of like had different product I use in between and I like I don't use it often like I used to well number one number two I feel it's a great product it is good it's just like the, the hassle of this brush right yet to be able to be screwing and screwing I just feel like that is just too much you know it's like that thing alone is taking a lot of concealer that I wanted to take or like some other applicator they do have a dope foot applicator that you can easily swipe on your face and um, that's probably that's was my least and you know but i still love it i love the coverage i love the undertone concealer and i think this concealer is like um deep warm golden undertone we it has a bit of yellow a little bit of yellow but it's actually towards the warm golden side and you know that's why i like it and this concealer does not crease there are some concealer that do crease like jeffree star it does crease my elf does crease but if you actually blend it out and and bake properly at the same time you will not see much of that difference but it does crease what will be me demonstrating a high brand concealer without a drugstore concealer so here we go elf and maybelline and l'oreal those are my drugstore concealer that i have yet today so that's it for my number six favorite concealer for dark skin women of color with deep golden you know warm or tear. that's what we're here for Coming up to my top five, this is the Cat Full D Lock It Cream Concealer. I still love this shade, and honestly, one of my favorite. But it's just something I cherish and I don't use all the time. And I don't know why. It's so creamy. It's very full coverage. It's very pigmented. You know, I'm just saying the same thing. I like this concealer. I just feel like a lot of product has come in between, and you know, product I do like a year ago is moved back down because i'm loving different new product entirely this is actually a very deep warm golden order turn there will always be a yellow in in concealer in terms of when you are making it from the lab there'll always be an inch of yellow to give you that golden richness obviously it says to be for neutral under turn if you are a neutral under turn skin person you can also use this but this is really really good for warm under turn golden order turn so we are coming to my top four favorite concealer is this um l'oreal infallible modern concealer and this is in the shade on a 338 as a drugstore product this is actually goes so this was launched towards the beginning of this year this concealer is cool to neutral old and two with a little bit of warm to it this is so full coverage this is competing with my high-end concealer it's creamy it blends really well and it does not crease at all honestly and i really like it and it's affordable like this is the best suit ever you know sometimes when i do my makeup i use tone concealers underneath my high one with a very warm deep undertone go down to 
and then I top it up with a bit of a cool neutral undertone just to actually brighten up my under eye you know where the light eats on my face and with this concealer I don't think I need to use a second concealer this is not really towards the golden undertone side but it's more like towards a cool to neutral with warm undertone and I really love it and it's beautiful on my skin too so this is my number four oh we're coming up to my number Theory. my number theory right so this one's gonna be a really of a long explanation of a long tin so just listen carefully so my third favorite concealer with yellow goldy and warm undertone this is the Fenty Beauty retouch concealer this was launched earlier this year and Fenty also increased the foundation line to 50 and this was like also 50 shade of concealer or 40 shade. to me i feel this concealer is just more like the jeffree star concealer it's just that kind of light area situation but it's actually really nice for my skin tone so this is mostly what i use to top up when i add another concealer i use this to top it up to brighten it up and i feel like i picked the wrong shade so this is 370 from the fenty concealer line and it says to be time skin with warm neutral undertone to me it's cool to neutral with warm undertone just like the way i just um talk about the infallible one they kind of similar the same but this is really much very very light if i decide to go buy um another concealer from the fenty line i don't think i'll buy 370 anymore because i use it as a topper i don't use it on its own so i want to actually have a concealer i will use on its own so this might be too light for you or not or if you want concealer from fenty that is is actually golden warm undertone that is not too light so that brings me to 390 so 390 is for tan to deep skin with warm yellow undertone so if you want more a bit of warm yellow you go for 390 so even if i want to buy again i think i might go for 390 or 400 i did try 400 in store when i went there last to buy a powder i don't know if the lighting can make you not see see it clearly but it's a really lovely shade as you can see that video that is me trying out the fenty beauty concealer in shade 400 so 400 is says to be for tan to deep skin with very warm undertone a little bit of golden in there but very very warm undertone and next concealer i would also recommend to my fellow dusky ladies or women of color is the shade 410 from the fenty beauty retouch concealer line and this is said to be for tan to deep skin with warm golden undertone like again we're talking this video is all about concealer with deep golden warm undertone a little bit of yellow as well so 410 will be for that tan to deep skin with warm golden undertone you know i don't have the actual golden undertone in this concealer right now but i've given you a explanation of the concealer you can get number you can get in the fenty that will actually give you the golden and the warm on the two we're talking about so this is my third favorite concealer so moving on to our number two and this was on my number one and this is a two-faced born this way Martin Sculpty concealer in chestnut last year or a year ago my number one I really like it this is my number two so it's not too far from number one I still love it now this is a concealer I use every day if going to work out anywhere it's just like it's just easy to grab very handy easy to apply on my face and it gives me that coverage and want and it's also complement my skin like you know with the coconut infusing needs and our uh, our uh, hyaluronic acid in it is actually like you know maintain my skin underneath you know the old kickiness so that's why i love this it's like my skin is breathable whenever i wear this um concealer and i really love it and this has to be deep with neutral undertone again whenever i use this concealer oh my god i don't need to even top it up with anything because i just feel that it's just perfect shit for me in my under eye but when i do top it up i use my fainty tiny bit tiny bit on top of this you know just like brighten my face out yeah to me i see a little bit of gold in order turn it's not too deep warm very like there's a bit of gold undertone there's like neutral to golden undertone and this is really nice so you can get a shade in chai um concealer and that is says to be um deep skin with 
golden undertone i haven't tried that i believe it would be a really really beautiful concealer this is my number two concealer that i also recommend to you guys this brings us to our number one concealer today maybe you already know maybe not i'm gonna just share a bit of insight to it i don't know if to say support or not support i i don't know what to say but i'm just gonna say is that i love this actual product honestly i'm gonna give credit where it's due i love the formula i love the coverage i love the packaging and how beautiful it is very simple and very affordable so this concealer is no other than the juvia's place makeup it came they came out with concealer contour foundation you know and powder and it's a beautiful concept and i like it for this video today we're talking about concealer for underneath the highs that got a very deep yellow warm goldy undertone and this fits to my number one so this is in the shade number 12 it actually comes in numbers it does not have a name to it it comes in number from number one to i believe maybe 24 shades that this concealer comes out with and the darkest shade is the number one and the lighter shade is the is it is the larger number so i'm in between so this is number 12 and number 12 is says to be for dark skin with cool golden undertone it's a really beautiful shade guys honestly in between those concealer i just mentioned earlier on this is actually my perfect concealer for my under eye and i don't need to top it up this makeup i have today this is the concealer i literally use for my under eye honestly i know i look beautiful i look wow brighten up and also this brand is a black owned makeup product you know i'm living for that i like what i see this concealer cost 14 dollars that's probably about nine pounds so yeah again let me remind you guys about the shade i just washed earlier on you can see everything has a different undertone pigment concentration formula warmth to it and but they all look nice and lovely and perfect lovely shade on my skin tone so details of this concealer is going to be down below so you can go check it out i'm going to try and put a link to it as well all of these products i have mentioned yet today are cruelty free vegan free paraben free probably no harsh perfume as well i guess that's the end of my top eight best concealers with yellow gaudy or warm undertone for women of color and for dark skin my melanie ladies i hope you guys enjoyed this video and my little insight and my tips that i just share with you guys and i hope you guys find your right shade your right concealer and your right undertone and you will be beautiful every day you're still beautiful now but you know sometimes when you wear makeup it makes you go one extra mile of beauty i feel pretty pretty good today so i'm gonna end this video right here guys i will be seeing you on my next video i don't know what's gonna be you just have to wait and watch out don't forget to subscribe to this video give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video if i did well and also leave your comment below because i really want to know your thoughts what do you think and on that note i will see you in my next video so take care of yourself and be nice towards us if you don't love yourself who will <laughs> bye